everybody, welcome to the video, and of course, in today's news video, it's gonna be super, super short. No! <clears throat> Sorry, just yelling at my dog. Anyways, bam! There you go. You guys can probably see that Requiem has a new research lab survey. If you're a research lab, do your surveys, people. And we even got a new update. Now, the weird thing about this update is that it normally doesn't happen on these days, and this update was super early. To top that off, this update is more of like a bug fix update, if you will. It's super tiny, and the TLDR tells us this. Or, <clears throat> sorry, I should start off with the title. The title of this update is called Fall Cleaning Edition. In the TLDR, you guys will see that they fixed some bugs and issues, cleared out old code, and they're starting a new experiment for some players that will show their entire full body avatar on the title screen instead of just your torso. They literally only have a general improvements and experience in this update, so of course, let's get straight into it. For general improvements and bug fixes, they fixed a bug that would show extra light strips above the My Dorms tab, fixed a bug where the free gift screen would cause the client to become unresponsive, then they fixed an issue where when trying to buy a gift, it took you to the item details page instead of just picking out who to gift it. They fixed an offset issue in the Watch UI that could happen anywhere, most often on lower end platforms, reduced the amount of 401 errors players were receiving, the thresholds for these errors are now higher, so you shouldn't see them as often, did some fall cleaning and cleared out many old dead experiment code and also fixed some memory regression with store pages inside the watch, which you love to see. No performance update, bug fixes, etc, etc. Then for experiments, they talk about being able to see your full full body avatar on the title. With this update, now you can admire your legs in all their splendor and glory before even signing in. Do you like my legs? Do you, do you like my legs? Yep. That's right, even on the small videos, I even talk about my channel memberships. Before we get started in today's little membership video bit, I just basically want to say big massive shout out to all the squidlings, there's a bunch of you guys who aren't even shouted out in videos and stuff like that, so I really do appreciate it. If you are in the perk calamari and above though, here is your shout out. And of course, big massive shout out to all these people who include Jack Tutorial, Dragon Boy, Bear to Bear, Not the Pup, Garlic Bread, It's Ready RR, Ghastly, uh, Dozer Blade Cats, BBB Burning Owl, Yoach Jakey, Raphael Cloud, Netflix and of course, Box David. Thanks for all the love, folks. And now back to the video. Requiem also had a creator announcement talking about a new update to contributor permissions. Basically, they go on to say, Hi, folks. Want to update the community on the issue we've been having with contributors being added to the rooms they have no involvement in. We are just implementing an update where contributors will have to accept an invitation to join as a contributor to the room. Baba! The process is the same as how co-owners are invited right now, and this update will be available on Monday, 9-16, which is in about five days, so that's pretty cool. But until then, no one will be able to add contributors to rooms, unfortunately. If you want to refresh on their contributor permissions, you can check out their dev blog and stuff like that, and of course, I will have the link down inside the description below. That's this entire video. Um, I wish Requiem added more, because I have no idea what I'm going to title this video, but I I'll figure it out. Anyways, like, subscribe, do all that crazy stuff. If you want to check out more Requiem news content that I have made, you guys should probably see a video on that side of the screen and of course you have three seconds to like the video or else we blow up three two one ah!